doesn't matter. Hi, so here we have a puzzle for you. And in this puzzle, you basically have 11 seats around a conference table, and each of these seats has a name card. But at this moment, when the guests come in, they all sit in their, in their wrong seats, so every one of them has the wrong name card. What the puzzle, the puzzle, in this puzzle, you basically have to show that there's at least one rotation where you can rotate all these seats, and there will at least be two people, two guests, sitting at the right locations. So how do you show something like that? Think, pause this video and think about it for a minute. Okay, now that you're back, um, the way you show it is using this principle called pigeonhole principle, which is a great principle that you can apply in a lot of different to solve a lot of different puzzles and math problems, which basically states that if you have n plus one balls and you have n boxes, then there must be a, a box that has more than one ball. It seems pretty obvious. So in this case, if you apply pigeonhole principle. Um, you have 14 rotations rather than this rotation, that is the initial rotation, and, but then you have 15 name cards that could be right. So there must be one rotation where there's at least two name cards right, because in this single rotation there are no name cards right. And that's pretty much how you show this. It's a really straightforward principle, but it's really useful for a lot of different things in math. And my board is falling off. Epic.